Hey guys, Traveling RN Kimmy here. Um, in this video, I wanted to talk to you guys about my paycheck, of course, because it is payday Friday. Um, I did 60 hours in this paycheck. Um, I wanted to, you guys, obviously, like I said, I'm going to be picking up a day extra each week so you guys can see exactly how much money you can make when you work the extra hours. Um, fortunately, unfortunately, because I got a rant right now, um, I have been having issues with the payroll specialist for the travel nursing com um, company I'm working for right now. When I say I am livid, I am beyond, beyond annoyed at this point. I've had multiple issues. Last week when I got paid, I kept reaching out to the person, reaching out to the person and they would not respond back. And then when they finally responded to me after I did the extra work to get the answer that I needed, they said that, oh, unfortunately, this won't be reflected in your paycheck. So they basically owe me like $200 from my last paycheck because my overtime hours, I did not get paid like you saw on the last video. So they said that it will be reflected on this week paycheck. It was not. That's one. Two, I worked, I worked 60 hours, like I said, on this paycheck, and I did not get my shift bonus. That is $800, guys. This paycheck was $800 short. I'm beyond livid. Because obviously, for the sake of the video, my point of this video, I wanted to show you guys exactly how much money I could make when I work 60 hours, and they just screwed me over. So, in that spirit, I have decided to take my own advice that I've been telling you guys and get another agency because of things like this. I was so angry that honestly, all night, last night, I filled out all the information that I needed for this one travel nursing agency that um, I'm excited to work with. And I'm going to make a separate video about that. Um, so you guys can see, the, I'm going to compare the company so you can see what the hell I'm talking about. But um, I am 100% changing agency for my next contract. So there's that. <sighs> now that I've gotten that off my chest, um, I will be revealing my paycheck to you guys. So here it is. So this is my paycheck. Um, as I told you, I work 60 hours on this paycheck. And um, not to beat a dead horse, but like I said, um, technically this paycheck is incorrect. I really was supposed to get my... Um, shift bonus because I worked an extra shift more than my 48 hours. So this check actually should have an additional shift bonus of $830. So with that being said, so my shift, um, so my total pay for this Con for this week should be four thousand five hundred and seventy one dollars that is what i'm supposed to be should have been should have made on this check so i could have given you guys an accurate number and i apologize for that but we're just gonna work with what we got and um and just keep moving from there so like i said in this paycheck i work 60 hours um when they did the calculation, my first 40 hours, I got $53 per hour because that is my hourly rate. And then for my overtime, it was 20 hours, which my overtime is a time and a half, which is 79.50 cents. And that's how I got that total. So 
I did, as you can see, my 401k is different because I actually lowered it for these last few paychecks because I wanted to maximize how much money I am getting back. And then when I get my next, um, when I start in January, well, actually, when I start my second contract, I was going to increase my pay again, but that is besides the point. Um, for this paycheck, as you can see, I worked, I, for my taxes, I apologize, for the taxes on this paycheck, I paid $1,400. $1,493. My reimbursement on this paycheck is $1,463. And my total take home is $3,674. As I said, technically this paycheck would have been more had I gotten the $800. And I'm going to just estimate um, I'm just going to make a quick estimate about what I think I technically should have gotten back um, with it after being taxed. I'm just going to say maybe half of that would have been gone. So I was expecting to see about $4,000 on this paycheck. So I can only estimate, unfortunately, guys, I'm so sorry that I can't give you the exact amount that I'm supposed to get on this paycheck because like I said, they did mess up my um, my pay this week, but I am working with my recruiter and hopefully they can fix it on the next paycheck. Okay, guys, so you just saw my pay breakdown. That is what I made. Um, Unfortunately, like I said, you weren't able to see how much money I would have made if the shift bonus was on it, but there's nothing I can do about that. Um, like I said, I estimate that I made probably about $4,000 with the shift bonus is what I would have made for 60 hours. Um, I will be making another video on Friday, of course, um, when so you guys can see how much money I made when I worked seven to two hours, which is what I'm doing this week. I've already done 60. I'm working tomorrow to make the total of 72 hours. Um, and you guys will see how much money I made on that. Um, unfortunately, I did just hear back from the payroll specialist and I won't the shift bonus that I am supposed to get on this paycheck, I won't be getting it on that check. So that check will also be just like this check where the shift bonus will not be reflected. You will only see how much money I get paid for my hourly rate and my overtime rate. Um, and that is all I will be able to show you because that is what is going to be on there. They made um, a, a detrimental mistake on all our pay, pay um, paychecks, not just me. Every travel nurse that works in the hospital that I am working at right now is having issues with our payroll specialists. So it is an ongoing issue. Unfortunately, I'm just going to have to deal with it. Um, but like I said, I am changing travel nursing agency, so I don't have to deal with this. Um, and I'll make a video about that, about the new agency that I'll be working with so that you guys can see the pros and cons between the agency because now I'll have something to actually compare it to. So if you guys have any comments, please like, subscribe, leave those comments down below. I'll try my bestest and I do try my bestest to get to you guys um, if you have any questions. And I will definitely see you guys in the next episode of this chaotic journey with me. Um, thank you so much for watching my videos and I hope you have a wonderful and blessed day.